सो वेलकम बैक गाइज टूडे वी आर सॉल्विंग द वन थाउजेंड एट हंड्रेड थर्टी सेकेंड क्वेश्चन ऑफ लीड कोर दैट इज चेक वी हैव टू चेक इफ द सेंटेंस इज अ पेनग्राम और नॉट अ सेंटेंस इज कॉल्ड पेनग्राम इफ एवरी लेटर ऑफ द इंग्लिश एलफेबेट appears at least once in that sentence like here the quick brown fox jumps over the lazy dog is a pangram i can say that because all the letters of the english alphabet is present at least one in this sentence okay uh, for uh, example if it is lead code then uh, I, i will return false because all the uh, alphabets are not present in it so what i can do is uh, i can take a set a set doesn't contain repeating elements it will store only the uh, even the repeating elements only once so first i uh, i check a condition that is if the length of the uh, sentence is less than 26 then i return false because at least it should have 26 uh, letters in it to have uh, all the uh, english alphabets in it so here i return false else uh, what i do is uh else what i do is i uh, traverse through the uh, st string and then i keep on inserting it uh, in the set and uh, if the at last the set size is not equals to 26 then we return false it should always be equals to 26 let's say t repeats uh, thrice or twice but in set it will be only once so it should always be equal to uh, 26 then it will return true or else it will return false okay so let's see another approach without using set that is uh, here i have checked the base condition again uh, i have checked the sentence length if it is less than 26 then i return false uh, else what i do is i traverse uh, i traverse all the english uh, alphabet letters and check their index in the sentence tree so if the it, it doesn't exist then it will return minus 1 index of uh, i have used index of function for it so it will return minus 1 if it doesn't exist uh, so if it is minus 1 that means we return false we break out okay uh, or else if the whole loop executes then at last we return true that means uh, we have all the letters of the english alphabet in our sentence so that's it for today thank you